Hello guys, so today is going to be a my April favourites video because April is nearly over but by the time this will be up it will be like I'll probably put it up on like the 2nd or 3rd or 4th or something like that and yes I'm still filming my phone but it is in HD so go click the 720p button um yeah because I'm really happy it's in HD because at least I can get a HD video up well my old videos weren't HD but they were just better quality but yeah um, it's my April favourites and I hope you enjoy the lip products I have on if you want to see my lips um, Elf Seductive why that's a bit close Elf Seductive lipstick with a bit of um, lip boom but the, only the lip gloss side because I don't know why I just thought I would of the OMG one but yeah, that's what I have on. Oh great, the sun's just gone to the direction of the blinds. That's annoying. Let me just go close the thing. Okay, that's better. Oh, now it's gone really dark. Um, so yeah, let's get started. That was a really long intro. So first I'll start with beauty as per there is not many beauty items because I say this in every favourites but I just don't really wear that much makeup. Um, yeah, like I don't wear makeup to school but then on weekends I don't I don't really put makeup on unless I have somewhere where I'm going. So yeah, and if I do it's normally stuff that I've already been wearing. Or, or no, I mean like it's old stuff so I've already included in favourites and stuff like that so yes there is only a few things but I hope you enjoy anyway and there is actually a video up this this month so yeah first thing is my body shop earth lovers lovers earth lovers shower gel in cucumber and mint you can't see that I know but I would focus but I'll like knock the camera over and I've, well, I've used this before, like one, and then I used up, and then I used several others, and then I um, got another one of these, so I used up after I'd finished off my other one, and I just, the smell is absolutely, oh, I, like, I love cucumber as it is, like, it's one of my favourite foods, I just love it, oh my god, look. Oh, um, but yeah, it just smells so nice, it lathers up really well, and it's just like, I've just been using it a lot, so that's why it's so it's fav this favourites really. Oh wow, I have straightened my hair today, by the way. Let me know what you think. Next, I have I have two Miss Sporty products actually. Um, a Miss Sporty So Clear Anti Blemish Actions Pressed Powder up to seven hours healthy looking skin dermatologically tested for young skin. <sighs> that was a mouthful. And it looks like this. It's just like a really tacky one. It was like one ninety nine, and I got this actually. In November, oh close, no, December for my um, dance show where we had to dress up as zombies because we adapted to Thriller. I just ha got a really cheapy one just to make my hair really light, my hair, my face really light. It's actually not that light and it like blends in like fine like this. Um, and I actually just use this as a normal powder because um, I don't suffer from like oily skin so my face, my makeup doesn't slip off my face but I just use this to lighten my concealer because it is a tiny bit orange for me and it just works really well, it's just like a cheapy powder and I've just been using it quite a lot just under my eyes to lighten my skin and stuff and when I don't really want to wear any makeup I'll just dust a bit over my skin and it's in 001 transparent but it's blendable so it's fine and then another thing, I think it's from the yeah, I think they're from the same range because this is called Just Clear and this is called So Clear. And they've got like the same packaging. Miss Sporty isn't like the best, but these two things are both kind of like cheapy things that you don't need to get like a good quality thing. Like I probably wouldn't buy like a lipstick from them or a foundation or anything. But yeah. Um, this is the So Clear Clear Mascara. No, Just Clear Mascara. And I use this for my brows as like a brow gel to set them in place and one I haven't been wanting to really be wearing um so I can make my eyebrows look really wet now when I haven't been wanting to wear like um powder to fill in like when I'm just being quickly getting ready I'll put some of this through my brows just hold them in place 
I've just been using it a lot. Like, I can't say if it's good or not because I haven't really used it that much. But yeah, I just like this. It's 101 clear. This is about like maybe three pounds or something. So yeah, these are just two cheapy things, but they're just really handy if I'm honest. Next, I have a L'Oreal LV Full Restore 5 Conditioning Repairing Spray Leave In Weightless Weak Limp and Damaged Hair. My hair isn't that like weak, limp, or damaged, it's a bit limp. Um, but this is like the only leave in conditioner that, that, that they had, and I, I wanted a leave in conditioner. It smells really nice, like really like salony. And I just use this, I spritz this like throughout my hair sometimes. And it kind of works as a detangler as well, and it's kind of like a leave-in conditioner, so you just leave it in, it makes your hair all soft. And I think I've noticed a difference, it's made my hair really soft. Like, normally, before I need to wash it, it gets greasy and knotty, but it's kind of only been getting greasy because I can't really help my hair from getting greasy. Um, and it has really been getting knotty, so yeah, I really like this, and I don't think it's very expensive either. The last thing is Real Techniques Brush. I got recently and this is the blush brush by these by Samantha Chapman on YouTube who I watch and then I got one of her brushes and I was really excited I haven't used it th that much because I said I haven't really been wearing much makeup this month but it looks like this um I really really love like the look of them as well um like this I think it's called duo fiber I think it's true. This is called Duo Fibre and it's like two colours and mm, I know this lipstick looks really weird because I haven't got like any other makeup on apart from this lipstick and then like I'm not dressed up at all but I just thought I wanted to put some on my lips just to make me look less boring. Sorry I was looking in the mirror then I wasn't just being like this because um, there's a mirror behind. But yeah anyway back to the thing. Um, it literally is so soft. It's like the softest brush I've ever felt in my life. It does the job like well, like ooh. it doesn't like shed or anything. It's just so soft, and I really like that it's metal handles. It's not like cheapy and plastic, and then this is like rubber. So yeah, I really, really, really like that. And yeah, really, I can't wait to use this more. Really, 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 really. And she actually tweeted me. Well, it might have been like I think it was just like the Real Techniques account, but they actually tweeted me. I said just put one of your brushes and they were like enjoy and I was like ah sorry I've just got a I've just got a Twitter but yeah sorry this is really long I keep getting distracted so yeah that's all beauty items I think that's all of them but yeah because I've got the list on my phone I'm filming on my phone so I don't know um and then now it's random items first random items are like hair stuff I've been quite liking pushing my hair back with like dolly bows like this from New Look which is just like a plaid one, plaid, plaid, whatever you call it. Where's the lacy bit and this is the oh, here it is. Just looks like this, this one's really cute and lacy and like really cute button and then these are like the loose ones, they're not like um, what do you call it, like wired but this bit's wired and then I have this one which is also the same but this bit's wired as well. Um, and this one's like a chiffon one, it's like a really nice print and like lacy, really like that one. And I just ordered this off Amazon, it is like a bandana, like a black bandana, um, like this. <laughs> it's like a big bandana and then I'll just show you how I do it. You fold it in half, corner to corner, opposite corner to opposite corner, and then you like roll it up really small. And then um, I I can only put this in with my hair up because otherwise it make it like makes a bulge so my hair goes too goes with this. So um, yeah, but I think just I like I've been liking pushing my hair back because it's getting a bit nicer. So I've just been liking pushing my hair back really. And yeah, I've been using these. This is from Amazon. This is from Primark, and this is from Look. Look if you were wondering. Next I have Catching Fire by The Hunger Games, um, <laughs> The Hunger Games Catching Fire, it has a random dolphin stick on it, I don't know why, I found it on my bed and then I thought I'd stick it in this book because I couldn't bother to put it in the bin, I'll put it in the bin now. And 
this is my favourites because I finished it recently and I really liked it. It's not as good as the first one in my opinion, but it was really good, especially the ending. The ending was like amazing, really confusing, but amazing. And yeah, I can't wait for the film in November. Ah, I'm so Anyway, I'm so excited for the film. Ah, uh, and yeah, really. So yeah, I finished that and I really enjoyed it. It was a bit laggy, draggy, draggy. It dragged a bit, but then I got into it and I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I finished it and I was so happy. The next thing is kind of really random. And it's nail wheels, just in general. I've been really enjoying like painting these like and doing blog posts and stuff. Whoa, that's gone dark. Um, so I did a crackle here. Um, this is mint candy apple I wouldn't go through all of them but I've just been really enjoying like painting painting these nail wheels and I think they're really really handy um, especially if you want me to do a video <laughs> if you want me to do a video of what's my nail oil sorry this is the lighting's gone all dark if you want me to do a video on what's on my nail wheels like all the colours that's on it then do leave a request below because I will definitely do that if you want me to and yeah, so I've just been really enjoying painting these and I got like these in a set of like 10 for Amazon from like £2 or something, so yeah. The last stuff is my JLS merch or merchandise. <clears throat> and I have this t-shirt to Jack the Lad Swing. It's one of their new t-shirt designs. I got this on Easter because um, there was a discount. And then this one, which has just a normal JLS logo on with the crystals. And I've been wearing these a lot lately because, well, I've been wearing them a lot as well. But then I found out, like, when the day when JLS fell up, and I was so sad. And I've been wearing these, like, even more than I did before, just for, like, sentimentality, if you, if you will. And, yeah, because I thought it was really sad that they broke up. And they were, like, my favourite band ever, and I cried, like, seven times or something like that. Something silly. But yeah, I won't go into that because people think I'm absolutely pathetic, but I don't care. Imagine if your favourite boy band or whoever is that for you, would be sad too. Okay, run over. But yeah, um, also I have Pop-Tarts. They're one of my favourites, but I don't have them to hand because they are downstairs. I'm too lazy to go and get them. But I finally tried Pop-Tarts because I went to this old-fashioned sweet shop with like American sweets. And I tried, I think I tried cherry ones and they were like really nice. And I was like, yeah, I finally tried like American sweets. And yeah. And there was, oh, Snapchat, that new app for iPhones. Um, I've been loving that lately. Like, send, if you don't know what it is, you send a snap to your friends and you can write on it and draw on it and stuff. And then you can set it for up to 10 seconds so they can only see it for 10 seconds. And so can you, you can't see them. And you can see your friends for only 10 seconds. And it's gone forever after that 10 seconds. And it's a really cool app. And you can send up videos and pictures and draw on them and stuff and play around with it. It's really fun. And then my song favourite is. Um, the Marvin Hume's JLS mixtape which he made like a couple of days after their split which was really really bad um, he made a mixtape of all like loads of JLS songs and I downloaded that to my phone I found out how to download it to my phone I just loved it when I listened to it it's really good really nice mix really nice DJing going on from Marv there and yeah and then my favourite YouTuber has been Fun for Louis um, I don't watch his main channel, Food for Louis, but I've started watching his vlogs and they're really interesting daily vlogs. Like, he's the only one that keeps up daily vlogs every day and, like, they're really, really good quality and really, really interesting. Um, so, yeah, I'll leave the link to Louis below. Well, I'll try to. And, yes, that is my favourites. I hope you enjoyed it. And I feel like I'm speaking really proper now. Um, yeah, and I hope you like my straight hair and I hope you like the HD. Make sure you click you clicked 720p and yes sorry it was 14 minutes long i'm gonna go now thank you for watching and i'll see you later bye